Let, let's see. Let's go on to the uh, second to last one, I think. Yeah, yes. second to last award. This one is, you know, obviously we didn't have as many after dark episodes this yes, year. Yes. But we still had enough to be able to do this category. And yeah. We'd like to know what you guys thought was the strongest episode. So this next award is the best trash taste after dark episode or moments. I guess right. this is episode here. Oh, I guess it's moments. Moments. Yes, moments. Yes. 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 moments. Yeah. So this is the best trash taste after dark moment. All right, let's go through. All right. Uh, the boys handling animals in Australia. <laughs> My favorite one of that is when I think, what was it? It was the baby crocodile or like the uh, the lizard or something was just freaking yeah, out yeah, in your yeah. hand. Yeah, they did not like being in my hand. <laughs> no. yeah, that was such a good episode though. I, I, I remember this this screenshot of me just petting that lizard just spread around on the Reddit to be like, yes, we will take over the world. <laughs> Don't you worry. <laughs> uh, we got everyone not getting the Among Us sounds oh, in the gamer yeah. quiz. Yeah, that hurt. That hurt. But I think the one that got clipped a lot was uh, all three of us going, "It's Among Us!" <laughs> like all at the same time. Uh, Gant winning the gamer quiz. We, we mentioned that earlier. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Gant accidentally opens up a cultured book. Oh yeah, I had to. Oh, I had yeah. to stop you from showing yeah. that on the stream. <laughs> like, no, 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 no. Uh, we got Gant spending ten dollars instead of a hundred dollars on the Christmas special. This was. Uh, I, th I feel like this was a personal favorite of mine because uh, the last challenge on the uh, Christmas special, I feel like epitomizes trash taste in a nutshell. <laughs> So we had, we had a challenge to buy presents for each other yep. and we had a hundred dollars to buy presents for mm. each other. And uh, we all did uh, something different for this challenge mm. because Joey followed the rules. Yep. I mistakenly uh, mistook a hundred dollars for $10. <laughs> <laughs> and Connor uh, completely forgot about this challenge and just brought shit from his house. Yeah. <laughs> Which I feel epitomizes each of our personalities pretty what, well to wait, a what team. What did I give you guys again? I don't even fucking remember. I probably threw it out. <laughs> I gave you a kiddie pool. Yeah, you gave me a kiddie pool. <laughs> Which I took back. <laughs> what did you give me? I don't remember what I gave I don't you. know. I was probably you remember what I gave Joey? One piece. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. English manga. Oh yeah, which I already had. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. That was a good gift. And, and Joey then, actually uh, tried and like thought long and hard for yeah. the gifts yeah. that he gave each other. Unbelievable. Yeah. And then uh, the last one is everyone gets drunk in the wine stream. That was my favorite after dark stream. Oh yeah, no, that, that was, was the one where the- well. John the, Perry the third. John Perry the third and the stream fucking destroying itself. Yeah, even, even like everyone got drunk, including the sets. <laughs> that was crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah. Great episode, but there yeah. can only be one winner. Let what was know. the best moment of the After Dark episode? Let him know, Connor. Voted by you at home. And the winner is, drum roll please. Uh, bam. Everyone gets drunk in the wine yeah. stream. Yeah. That was my favorite. I do think that was a very, very good episode. That was, that was so, so fun. fun. Just involve alcohol uh, and going on live. What just we should get shit more just, on stream. Just being <laughs> smug and beating Sydney. It was just such a good combination of, it was just great. It was, I'm so happy. It was that like drunk uh, energy as well. They just yeah. fueled it. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, what Sydney in this thumbnail looks awful. <laughs> yeah. The mood on did Sydney dirty. In they, 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 got a, they got a screenshot, all right. All right. Like or yeah. <laughs> what was the top three? So everyone gets drunk in the wine stream with 18.2%. Oh, oh, it's actually quite close. That's very close. Okay. In second place, the boys handling animals in Australia. Was oh, that was a very fun Ooh, episode very as well. Close. That was yeah. fun, yeah. And in third, God accidentally opens up a culture book on stream with 16.8%. <laughs> that was funny. Damn, 1% difference in all of them. So it's very, very close. That was very, very close. Well, glad to know you enjoyed those moments. But we have one award left. Isn't that right, Gon? Yes, we have one final award, mm -hmm. which is the best trash taste episode of the year. God, how do you decide? Yeah, I don't know. Um, the, I mean, the hardest part uh, of this is that I can barely remember all the episodes of the year. So I don't know how you guys ended up voting on it yourselves. Mm -hmm. Uh, but there were a lot of memorable episodes this year, a lot of different guest episodes that were very, very memorable, which is why we decided to include it this year. Um, and uh, yeah, should we get to the nomination? Let's find the out. Best Trash Taste episodes this year. So we have episode 120, Nile Red, episode 111, Pro ZD, episode 137, Pete, Episode 123, Shower Thoughts, which is the first non-guest episode. Uh, episode 124, Felix. Episode 127, Charlie. Episode 145, Hassan. Episode 114, Ludwig. Episode 101, Emily. That was the first of this year. 
uh, the second hentai episode 144, the road trip special, and our boy got married episode 107. So it's kind of all over the board. Yeah, yeah. wholesome episodes, a lot of guest episodes, obviously because yeah. they're very diverse, but uh, some good triple trash taste ones in there. Yeah, I mean, I I personally just want to give it to the special but like i don't know uh yeah it's kind of tough really yeah. i mean all of these i wouldn't be mad mm. yeah yeah episodes. all of them i had a lot of fun filming that's why they got nominated mm. uh i feel the road trip special turned out pretty well as well mm. uh but it took so much fucking time and effort <laughs> uh, way too much way too that's much. Yeah. uh that we only ended up releasing one special this year right yeah i think so yeah, yeah. No, only one special which we said we we're gonna do more and we didn't yeah so we sorry lie. <laughs> <laughs> honestly yeah i'm okay with any of these winning they're all fucking amazing episodes um yeah i don't know what's a favorite uh, yeah i don't know which one really i want tough. to win it's it's all good memories mm. uh but there can only be one, one winner for oh what God. you guys voted as the best episode this year to I'm cap hyped. off to cap off this third year of trash taste all right here we go which is why the winner for the best trash taste episode in i guess season three yeah season three of trash taste is <laughs> the pete episode oh! oh pete with the triple w <laughs> pete sweep pete sweep pete sweep baby damn god well deserved. damn well deserved, well deserved if we did a season three popularity poll of characters pete would be number one <laughs> he I just think sweet it's just a pete. testament to pete's character and being able to tell a story that's engaging. You know, a, lot, a lot of people weren't familiar with Pete when they went into the episode. Yeah. And I think they left feeling really engaged and yeah. really fascinated by uh, a very talented storyteller. Absolutely. Yeah, I mean, I, th I think quality speaks for itself because when we first released that episode, uh, going into like the analytics, the Pete episode performed pretty like average or even like maybe below average, mm. just because a lot of people didn't know Pete back then. Yeah. And uh, it soon over time turned out to be one of the most successful episodes. I think it's got over uh, 2 million views now. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which is That's just- crazy. A, which is yeah. just a testament to the quality of the episode itself. So yeah. congratulations, congratulations, Pete. Pete. Congratulations, you congratulations, Pete. You goddamn deserve it. Well we'll be deserved, well deserved. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, thank you guys for tuning in to the annual Trash Taste Awards. Um, and thank you for another fucking amazing year of Trash Taste. <sighs> great, yeah, it's been a great year. The fact that we're able to do this for 150 episodes and you guys are still loving it, still coming back every week, makes us just super fucking happy. Yeah. So we appreciate you guys so much. And uh, on to season four, on I guess. On to season four. Yeah, I think the big thing this year I'll always remember is this is the year that we got to like interact with you guys for mm. the first time after just <laughs> being through a screen and All just seeing comments and seeing the Reddit post. This was the year mm. that we actually got to meet you guys, shake your guys' mm. hand, put, maybe even perform in front of you guys. Yeah. Uh, and it was a fucking incredible feeling. Mm -hmm. And we hope to do more exciting things in the coming year. Some of which we've already announced the tour. Yes. We, we are very, excited to go meet our Europe bros. Keep your eyes uh, out on that guys. And uh, I know we talk about this every year, but specials, but we've, we actually have already some in the backlog. So yeah. do Ooh. not worry about that. Uh, with that, there will definitely be more specials this year. Yeah, I mean, I think for us, it was the specials. We're just trying to get a better way of making them because mm -hmm. right now, all the other specials are just us making them. Yeah. yeah. And the problem is, is that we all do our own things. And <laughs> yeah. We also struggle to just keep up with trash taste in general. And our so, own personal. Yeah. So, you know, yeah. we're trying to, we're trying to try some new stuff out, maybe bringing more people on board mm. to try and help the process. So yeah. we want to get to the point where trash taste specials are more frequent and hopefully higher quality. Mm. Yeah. Uh, so we're working on that. Uh, it's, we're not just doing nothing. Stuff yeah. is coming. Yeah, and of uh, course, it's all a big uh, thanks to you guys who support us on the Patreon as well. Oh yeah, if you guys, if you guys weren't supporting us yeah. over on the Patreon over there, we wouldn't be able to do half the things that we do. So we super fucking appreciate you guys for sticking mm -hmm. to the Patreon. Mm -hmm. and